Hello, hello dear viewers, welcome to our channel, it's very good to have you here. In this video, we are going to have a look at some causes of noisy manual transmission. In this video, we are going to focus on seven causes that make noise in a manual transmission gearbox of this kind, for example. Well, the noises that are coming from a manual transmission of this kind can be classified depending on when they are happening. For example, there are noisy manual transmission when the gear is in neutral, like this. And there are cases when noisy manual transmission will happen on one of a specific gear. If you select any of the gear and uh, noisy it will become. And the other one is when it comes noisy in all the gears. What, whatever the gears that you select, sometimes the manual transmission can be very noisy. So in this video, we are going to see some of the causes focusing on seven of them. Well, for example, let's say the manual transmission is noisy in neutral. Now, as you can see, this manual transmission in, is in neutral. The counter shaft gears are running, the output gears are running, but there is no power going out to the differential and to the drive gear, to the driven wheel. Now, when the transmission in neutral like this and when there is noise, we usually focus our, our attention to parts that are moving. Now, as you can see, there are parts that are moving, counter shaft is in action, main speed gears are in action, and the input shaft is in action. So, if you happen to have a noisy manual transmission in neutral, just concentrate on those parts that are spinning right now. For example, number one, it could be a problem with the input shaft bearing. If there is wear on the input shaft wearing, that bearing will be noisy, even when the gear is in neutral. With the engine running and gear in neutral, that bearing, if there is a problem with the input shaft bearing, if it is worn out, it can become noisy. So number one, input shaft bearing worn out. Number two, damage in the main drive gear bearing. These main gears, they are riding on a roller bearing, on a needle type bearing on the output shaft. So if there is a problem with any of these bearings that are supporting the main speed gear, that can be a cause of noisy manual transmission in neutral. So number two, damaged main drive gear bearing. Bearings that are supporting this main speed gears, if they are damaged, that can also lead to noisy transmission. Number three, because the counter shaft is now in action, damaged counter shaft bearings. See, the counter shaft is supported in either side by bearing. So if there is a problem with these bearings, that can also make a noisy transmission in neutral. And the other one is, if there is damage to any of the teeth on the counter shaft, or any of the teeth on which the counter shaft is engaged, if there are damaged teeth on the counter shaft, that can cause noise. So number four, damage or war counter shaft gears. And number five, if there is a problem with the counter shaft and if the counter shaft has excessive in play. Now, because this is a teaching model, it's running at low speed, but when it is actual vehicle, it is running at high speed. So due to that excessive in play, if there are excessive in place caused as a result of wear on the component, that can also become noisy. And the other thing, in neutral, if you happen to have a noisy transmission, <coughs> damage on this clutch release bearing. Especially if you are moving the clutch and touching, depressing the clutch or releasing it, and if you happen to have that noise exaggerated, then if that noise increases, it's more probably it is caused by faulty release bearing. So these are some of the five of the causes that can be leading to noisy transmission in neutral. Now, there are times when the transmission will become noisy in all gears. Now, if the transmission is noisy 
every time ghee is selected, it can be caused by insufficient lubrication. If there is insufficient lubrication inside the manual transmission gearbox, that can lead to noise on almost all the gears because lubrication is common to all the gears. That can also be a cause for noise. So number six, insufficient lubrication can also lead to noise all the gears. Then there are times when the noise will appear every time one gear is selected. For example, when you select second gear, if noise appears to be on the second gear, then that could be caused by worn or damaged synchronizer assembly for that gear. If it is the second gear, synchronizer assembly for the second gear. If it is third gear, synchronizer assembly for third gear. If it is fourth and if it is first gear, all the shifting mechanism for that particular gear might be in question. So these are the causes that can lead to noise, especially when one particular gear is selected. So dear viewers, these are some of the noises that can contribute to a noisy manual transmission. To summarize, a damaged or faulty input shaft bearing, number one, damaged main drive gear bearing, the main drive gear bearing, bearings that are supporting the main speed gears, worn counter shaft bearing, counter shaft is supported in either side, if there is damage to those bearings, that can be number three, worn or damaged counter shaft in play, excessive in play of the counter shaft, that can also lead to uh, noise, and number six, if there is insufficient lubrication, that will cause noise in almost all the speed gears whenever they are selected that can be a cause of noisy transmission and if gear is selected and if we have noise and a particular speed gear that could be related to gear damage or synchronizer assembly for that particular gear so if you happen to have this kind of noise in a manual transmission pinpoint the source of the cause you can find it by selecting the different gears and listen to it attentively and pinpoint what time that noise is appearing. So these are some of the noisy manual transmission reasons and the remedy is simply if you find out which cause the problem is arising from then you might be required to replace the bearing or if there is a damaged gear you have to replace the gear if it is lack of lubrication Assess the, the extent of damage due to the lack of lubrication and refill your transmission. If it is coming from the release bearing, replace the release bearing with a new one. So this is how you can fix noisy manual transmission. Well, dear viewers, this is all we have for you in this presentation. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notification so that you will be notified whenever we come up with another video. Till then, stay safe.